Hey everybody, it's Colette with Blessings Craft Therapy with another project. Friends, let's make some super cute trays out of these Dollar Tree burner covers. I know. All right, so I have two sets of these. So you're going to have two small ones and two big ones. So you're going to buy two packages at Dollar Tree. Then I'm doing the big ones first. I put some permanent glue on. You could use Z6000. I can't. So I'm using Gemtac. And then I do some hot glue and I sandwich them together. So um, they are flat part to flat part. See? And then you just make sure they're straight and squeeze them together. And I do the same for the little ones as well. Ta-da! Now we have one set of each. Perfect. Now I'm going to use this, um, what is that? Metal ribbon. I think it's called metal ribbon. And I'm going to put my um, permanent adhesive and I'm going to do them in just, you don't want to put it the entirety, but I do little spaces and I go all the way around the burner cover, okay? Um, because we're going to put in the in between those, we're going to do hot glue. So it sticks immediately, right? Right. So we're going to do this all the way around. Perfect. All right. So I take my metal ribbon and I measured ish on, on the inside just to see how much I'll need. And I cut it. And um, I'm going to tell you right now, put your hot glue on, but use a finger protector because metal, <laughs> it took a minute for me to get this. Hey, guess what? Metal gets hot and hot glue's hot. Uh, anyway, so I use this finger protector and I'm going to invite you to hold it there until it really adheres. If you don't, it's going to flop all over the place and get you angry and get frustrated and all the things. All right, so we're going to do this all the way around. It's that easy. I know. It's crazy. I'm so excited about it because this metal ribbon fits perfect in between these two burner covers. Like, I'm not even kidding how perfect. It was like it was made for this. I love it so much. Look at it. And then I get to the very end and I just cut the excess off. I mean, obviously when I measured, I wasn't exact. And then I put some extra hot glue down and then um, I put some more at the very end. Again, protect your fingers. It's gonna be hot, okay? Okay. And then this is just the very end of it. And I, again, use my finger protector. Um, again, I would invite hold it so that it doesn't move. But look at how pretty this is. Are you kidding me? Like, that's it. It doesn't get any easier than that. All right. So next, I have some of the jute rope from Dollar Tree. And I did the same process. You may not need the permanent um, adhesive, but I figured why not? Um, I did the same thing. I just put a little dot every so often. And then I went over with hot glue. And then I just started wrapping, like glue, then wrap, glue, then wrap, all the way around. Like, friends, I know, I know. You're probably thinking, like, what in the what? This is so easy. I know. I was so, listen, I don't know about you, but every once in a while, I need just a really simple but super pretty project, like one to boost my confidence this was the one for me. I was like, yes, I like it. I feel super good. And I didn't spend a ton of money or a ton of time. And it looked cool. So anyways, so yeah, this is all I did. I just keep going around. It's so much fun. And you can put so many cool things on it. And because we didn't paint it, you could use it for food or whatever you wanted. I mean, you know, serving platter, whatever. Anyways, friends, I hope this inspired you. If nothing else, I hope it entertained you. Have a great night and thanks for watching. Thank you.